And in fact, we are going racing as they get a plummet into the first corner. We see Marshall still in the race lead, McIntyre still in second place as they go down. It doesn't seem to be too many movements in the top two or three, but we are seeing Edmondson and Nola going side by side. Brennan's moved up a place as well into fifth position. And uh, as they plummet down to the second corner, in fact, Marshall's under a little bit of pressure by McIntyre, Steve. The uh, yellow TT is getting a bit feisty as we see a bit more side-by-side -side action in the background. We're on board with Edmondson, and he is obviously following the two drivers ahead. Marshall, will tell you what, Edmondson was getting very close to the backside of McIntyre there, who seems to favour the curbs a little bit more. As McIntyre now is the race leader, and he's under attack now by Marshall as well. Here comes Nolo up the inside of Edmondson as we're looking... Further back at Brennan now, but here is Nolo up the inside into third place, into second, third place he goes. Sorry, I got a bit confused. I'm looking at the timing tower there, but the leaders are side by side as well. McIntyre's still ahead. Marshall's got his nose, but McIntyre's on the inside of the second corner. We've seen so often at the Nurburgring how easy it is to defend around the outside of the first corner because you just have the inside for the next two. And I tell you what, Marshall's actually under, actually under attack by Nolo, who's got a really good run on him now and makes his way, he gets his nose into second place. On board now for Neil as we go. Yeah, there we go. Nola up the inside of the race leader McIntyre, but he goes under steering through McIntyre, trying to get the pace back from him, and indeed he does. As Marshall now tries to go around the outside, and see that's exactly what you were talking about. Nola activating the push to pass, but then getting a big amount of understeer. But Dave's definitely got the inside there, and I think he's got that move done. Yeah, speaking of getting the move done, Edmondson's trying to do some uh, moving and shaking and baking as well. He's actually got his nose ahead. Marshall's gotten back into the race lead as well, by the way, and McIntyre's actually fallen down to third place. So uh, Edmondson's got himself back up to second. Get back to him in a minute because he's actually, uh, well, Nola's going through on McIntyre. He's used the push to pass. He's got his nose ahead. He's got his entire car ahead, and he's timed it right so he can get into that chicane without understeering wide. Good move by Nola. Nola just defending that and seeing that off. And actually, the uh, race lead battle as well between Edmondson and Marshall was cut off a little short because I think Edmondson maybe understeered off through the final corner. So as Brennan gets overtaken by Stapleford, he's now going to try and get the cut back, the reverse back on him. But it's going to be so difficult. He'll really need to make sure that he's getting on the apexes, making sure he's alongside him now. But it's such a long left-hander now, Steve, that he just... You can't get the car turned in. The driver's on no. the apex for such a long amount of time. The momentum is really difficult to carry around there. And now Butler's actually got past on McIntyre. So uh, maybe McIntyre tried the move on Nola. It didn't go quite well. And actually Butler's stormed through the field to try and catch these guys back up. And he looks like he has in fourth place. On the outside, tries to go McIntyre deep on the brakes. Goes Butler a little bit too deep, and there's more contact as luckily Butler gets away with that. Marshall is going to take the race victory for race number one here in the TT Cup at the Nürburgring. And a big hit on the backside by Butler, sorry, by McIntyre on Butler again. And you can't take your eyes away from this, Steve. It's absolutely thrilling. Marshall's taken home second flag. <laughs> second place, Edmondson. Nola in third, but wow, 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 McIntyre and Butler. We are indeed ready for race two. We've got the lights, we'll have engine noise, and we are away. And it's O'Farrell who's on pole position. These two drivers ahead have got an absolutely storming start. Fairclough in third place. He showed good pace in practice. He didn't manage to do it in the race, but he may have a second chance now. Side by side go the two leaders. O'Farrell still has it by quite a stretch. And actually, Thorne and Fairclough are now going side by side. O'Farrell, what a start, Steve. It certainly is, and uh, a big stage exit left moment for one of the drivers, and that is Edmondson. We see Smith there uh, trying to go down the inside, and I think he's going to get that move done. He is, he's up into fifth place now, O'Farrell down to six. Fairclough and Smith going side by side as well. Fairclough's got his nose ahead, but it's a big late break on the... Uh, well, that was uh, Smith, I thought he was going to go for the overtake on Smith, but no, there's been more contact as they go three wide into the second quarter. It's never oh. going to go well, Steve, but it hasn't. That right there was great sportsmanship as Stapleford ended up hitting Brennan, uh, forcing him off the circuit. And then as Brennan rejoined, Stapleford came off the throttle and let him back through to take the race lead to, to restart this fight. Brennan doing a good job of leading this race so far, but he's just gone straight off. Curse the commentator. He's gone straight off and Stapleford will be thinking, flashing the light, boosters on. Here's my opportunity to try and get him up the inside. He's going to be on the outside. I tell you what, they may well go three abreast yet again. And we saw this happen in the second corner with a few other drivers. We don't want to see it go the same way here because it's a great battle for the race leader. We want to see it through to the end. Nola doesn't make it three wide, but he is going to make it up the inside here and into second place. 
Nola takes the race victory for race number two here, the TT Cup. Second time of asking that we shouted that out. But Stableford did end up with second place. Hayden on the podium. Out of nowhere, Marshall ended up in fourth. Woo! 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 Woo!